Andy, you're with us. Okay. And he's with us, it's okay, go. Uh, from the ground, as you can, up, push up your feet, and you'll say, you're ready. Okay. Let's go now. My name is Matthew. I've been playing for the Glasgow Green Reapers for about a year and a half by now. Um, and yeah, it's the only club I've played for so far. Uh, I am Tema. I've been playing for Glasgow for the last almost two years. And I was a uh, Barcelona player four years before. You win by scoring points, which works by putting the quaffle, which is a slightly deflated volleyball, through the hoops that are here behind us. Um, people can do that by passing around the ball, they can defend by tackling, um, at the same time they have to have brooms. The thing that makes it more complicated is that you also add beaters, who have dodgeballs that can prevent you from scoring by beating you out, um, and you also have a snitch, which is worth 30 points and which ends the game. Yeah, so this is a quaffle, it's a slightly deflated volleyball, it's the ball chasers and the keeper use to score goals, get points, each goal is 10 points. Um, and this is the bludger, which is a slightly deflated dodgeball. The beaters use them to beat out people, which pretty much makes them it makes it possible for them to attack. You have to drop the ball if they're holding it. You have to get off the room and go back to their hoops to remount in order to re-enter the play afterwards. And what sort of reactions have you had from friends and family um, and members of the public, like watching you play here? Um, what sort of what's the reaction been? There is a lot of different reactions. Most of it are like not really understanding what's going on, and especially family. I think that they, they were mostly surprised. But I was attracted to it being quite different and, and a mixture of different sports. It's a full contact sport, so it's not. It sounds like nerdy and not a real sport, but indeed it's a very tough sport and very complex. And I, I, I liked it when I when I saw it first time. I was like, oh, damn. For me, it was that it has the few elements that make it much more interesting. I did some basketball before, and it is literally just people with one ball all concentrating on one system. Here you have the additional complication of a room, you have the additional complication of meters weaving through the quaffle game, um, which makes it a lot more interesting. And it was difficult to convince my family that it is a real sport. Um, but, you know, when you show them a few matches of the World Cup or something like that, they have to admit that it's a thing.